Welcome to Influence Weekly, the podcast that dives deep into influencer marketing and the creator economy. Explore news, trends, hear stories, and get behind the scenes with industry leaders. I'm Kalani, and in today's episode, we're unraveling the twists of promises made and broken, both by brands and within the bustling world of Finfluencers. From BMW's social media misstep to the tightening grip of regulations on financial influencers and a brokerage firm's record-setting penalty for unchecked influencer campaigns. Let's dive into today's sizzling story. Picture this. A TikToker named Risa Tisa captures hearts and headlines with her viral saga of broken promises from an ex. As she spills the tea across TikTok in her series, Who TF Did I Marry?, major brands perk up and pitch in with offers of freebies. Hilton, check. Delta, flights on them. But then, BMW steps into the spotlight, hinting at a dreamy, dark blue X5 for Risa Tisa, a promise that echoed her ex's unkept vows. TikTok cheers, the crowd goes wild, and BMW bathes in a moment of marketing glory. But wait. There's a plot twist. The car, like her ex's promises, never materializes. BMW's magic moment fades to black as they ghost on the gift, sparking a TikTok torch and pitchfork brigade demanding justice for Risa Tisa. Where is Risa's car? becomes the rally cry in the comments, turning BMW's win into a cautionary tale of social media promises and pitfalls. In a digital age where brand promises are public and viral moments are gold, BMW's saga underscores a crucial lesson. Fast moves on social media require not just speed, but clarity, commitment, and a solid follow-through. It's a high-wire act where the safety net is built of trust and transparency. So, as we navigate the whirlwind world of influencer marketing, let's remember, in the court of public opinion— It's not just about making the promise, it's about keeping it. Stay tuned, influencers and marketers alike, for more tales from the front lines of digital dazzle and drama. Next up, we're diving deep into a headline that's got the financial corner of the internet on its toes. Picture this. The UK's Financial Conduct Authority, or the FCA, just dropped a bombshell on the buzzing world of finfluencers. You know, those savvy social media gurus who've been guiding us through the maze of crypto stocks and everything finance on TikTok and Instagram. Now, under the watchful eye of the FCA, finfluencing is no longer just about charisma and clicks. With new guidance that reads like a legal thriller, finfluencers are finding themselves in a tight spot. Picture this. Two years behind bars or facing unlimited fines for slipping up on the new ad rules— And it's not just about being in the UK. If your posts can be seen there, you're on the hook. Lucy Castledean, the FCA's Director of Consumer Investments, put it bluntly. Promotions aren't just about the likes, they're about the law. It's a stern reminder that with great influence comes great responsibility, especially when it comes to promoting financial products. The crackdown isn't just for kicks. Last year alone, Over 10,000 promotions got the red flag for not playing by the rules. And with retail investing hotter than a summer in Ibiza, the FCA is stepping in to make sure that financial advice on social doesn't turn into a Wild West show. For Finfluencers, this means getting creative with compliance. Those snappy TikTok videos and Instagram carousels, they'll need clear, continuous risk warnings that don't disappear faster than a swipe. It's a game changer especially on platforms where brevity reigns supreme. The FCA's message is crystal clear. If you can't fit the risk warning, maybe think twice about fitting the promotion. It's a bold move to protect consumers in an era where investment advice is just a scroll away. So, as we navigate this new landscape, remember, when it comes to finfluencing, it's not just the profits that count, but the protection of the people tuning in— Make sure you stay informed, and let's see how this financial influencer saga unfolds. And for our finale, strap in for a saga that's rewriting the rulebook on financial wisdom in the digital age. The scene? 
a bustling brokerage named M1 Finance, known for its sleek app and savvy investment strategies. Their master plan? To harness the unbridled power of social media finfluencers to skyrocket their user base. Between 2020 and 2023, M1 Finance enlisted an army of 1,700 influencers, turning heads and opening wallets across the internet. But here's where the plot thickens. The Financial Industry Regulatory Authority, or FINRA, wasn't buying the hype. In a groundbreaking move, they slapped M1 Finance with an $850,000 fine. Why? It turns out, in the rush to go viral, M1 Finance let these influencers run wild without checks or balances, leading to a storm of misleading advice. This isn't just a slap on the wrist. It's FINRA's first ever penalty for a company's social influencer antics, signaling a tidal wave of change for how financial advice is peddled online. Bill St. Louis, FINRA's enforcer-in-chief, put it bluntly. In an era where tweets can sway market tides, rules of engagement are more than just guidelines. They're lifelines. The crux of the matter? M1 Finance's influencers, decked out with flashy graphics and a guide on how to woo would-be investors, promise the moon, often bending the truth about the perks of margin loans and the allure of low fees. Take TikToker Gil Oliveira's viral skit, for example— which played fast and loose with the facts, all in the name of likes and signups. With nearly 40,000 new accounts credited to these digital Pied Pipers, the strategy seemed like a win. But in the high-stakes world of investment, truth in advertising isn't just good manners. It's the law. And as FINRA's crackdown shows, the line between influencer marketing genius and regulatory misstep is finer than ever. As we zoom out, the message is clear. In the rush to capture hearts and minds and wallets, the Wild West days of FinTalk and its billion-view hashtag hype face a new sheriff in town. With FINRA's landmark action, the call for transparency, accuracy, and accountability in financial advice has never been louder. So as we wrap up today's journey through the twists and turns of influencer marketing, let's remember... In a world where advice is a swipe away, the real investment is in the truth. Stay tuned, stay skeptical, and always read the fine print. Thank you for tuning in to Influence Weekly, where we explore the ever-evolving landscape of influencer marketing and the creator economy. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more valuable content in our upcoming episodes. See you next week.